I click and by now you agree to immediate delivery of content. It's like by clicking buy now, there isn't a buy now button. Anyway. Claim rewards from contract. My rewards. Oh, a Gwent card back. Wanna play around a Gwent? Sure. Breathtaking. Okay, so another card back and a coin. Coin being useful. Was that just flipped at the beginning to says say who goes first? Claim rewards from contract. Complete the mosaic for rank 30 in standard mode. So it's like journey a premium feature that I should be ignoring. I should just be clicking on play, should I? Standard mode. April season, two days left. Play against worthy opponents. Progress your rank and earn rewards. Somehow, is rank 30 the bottom? Patience is a virtue. Weekly mode. Fresh alternatives to standard mode. Play with a special set of rules. Right. Draft. And training. Well, I feel like I should just go with standard mode. Shouldn't I? Change music, change game board. Change leader skin. How about you give me the play ga button game? Change coin. I don't wanna... Right. So I have to choose the deck that I would like to. These two are my invalid decks. Right. Well, we're just gonna go with the starter deck. Right. Play. We're only... how long are we into the stream? 20... 28 minutes. And we're only now just getting to a game. Because there was so much other stuff. Help if I knew anything about this deck, wouldn't it? Round one. Oh, I'm sorry if I take a long time, whoever's playing me. Uh, don't like you. Well, maybe that was just a sign that I needed that there then. I don't know what I want. Deploy Purify an enemy unit, so that's not useful. Deploy Dominance. Summon all copies of this unit from your deck to this row. Did I have both of them in here? No, so just go with that one. <laughs> Has that ended the turn? I'm assuming it has ended the turn. <laughs> I have no idea. It, it flipped it over. Yeah, it did. Nasty wounds, those. But you'll live. Boost the unit by one. And okay, four. That's four goes up. Um, purify. Remove all statuses. Does charged include, you know, count as a status? But I, I have dominance. You control the highest unit on the battlefield. So it would do one of mine. Um, 
Wait, damage an enemy unit by two. Also spawn frost on its row for one turn. Oh. Okay, well we'll leave that for a bit then. Boost an allied unit for the duration of frost and the opposite row. And I'll just do that. Apparently I've unlocked an achievement. Destroy a unit with zeal before it's triggered. Ah. I'm achieving, apparently. Finally. So now it's a Migo? Yeah. Whenever receives a boost, summon all copies of it from your deck. Fine. Um... I mean, I'm going to play one more card and then I'm probably going to pass, aren't I? Damage an enemy unit by two. No, I don't want to do that now. Spawn Frost on an enemy row for four turns. No. Oh. Does he not have another one? Okay. What is my power as well? Order. Move an enemy unit to the other row. He just played all his things. That's gonna, at the start of the turn, highest unit. So if I pass now, um, I'll be on 13. He'll be on 10. So it won't be that difficult for him to get something else out there. What is this? Um. There is no Another achievement, apparently. Off it on. Fill your opponent's side of the board with cross presumably. And we'll just pass. Because they have a bit of an uphill battle, I think. I still don't know what my... Uh, move an enemy unit to the other row. Spawn Frost in its row for two turns. So I lost the round. And in the end, what, we played the same number of cards. Or maybe a... That's saying they got eight cards, I got nine. Three draws. Right, I don't want two of those because they're not really useful. Uh, Someone old spear tip from your deck to this row. Again, I don't want two of those. But that leaves me with two of these things. You need to damage a random enemy unit on the range row by one. Right. So I don't want to put things in the range row. Although I could lock it. Deploy. Spawn frost on enemy row for two turns at the end of your turn if there is frost on the opposite row boost itself by one. Spawn Frost on enemy row for four turns, for, for two turns, then replay a bronze wild hunt unit on both enemy rows for two turns. 
So. units receives a boost damage around on enemy unit okay. so I could move it back there it will then be frozen uh, a bit more when it says purify remove all statuses but that's not statuses is different to like abilities lock is disables in this disabling the abilities um we've caught another So do I have dominance if... I mean, we're tied for highest, so I assume we still do knowledge unit by the total duration of cost on the opponent's side, which is only one, so it's not worth doing that at the moment. But, um, he should also die next time. Um, move an enemy unit to the other row. Target moves to the row affected by frost damage by two. Let's do that. Boost an allied unit and all its copies by one and give them armor. Turning on deploy though, so that's fine. Timer three. Summon old spear tip from your deck to this row and increase its base power by six. Then banish self. If old spear tip takes damage, summon old spear tip from deck and then banish self instead. I have what? Enough. Do something. I know. I'm not mucking about. I just don't know how to play the game. I apologize. Um. Well, we have dominance, so we'll just play. Fall overboard, and I'm not jumping in after you. This knowledge unit by two. Okay, so I no longer have dominance, do I? Um, spawn frost. Frost out. Formation order. Beast knowledge unit by two. I don't really understand this card, so I might as well play it so I can try and understand it. I have unlocked an achievement. Play a bronze and a gold card in a multi play. Left, right, left, right. Someone old spirit it from your deck. No idea. Um. Run, run. Do not get far. So he's passed. Well, and I just. Pass, right? But I lose my old spear tip thing, which I guess is not a good thing, so I'll probably end up losing the whole thing. Okay, so we only have six cards. 
unless there's some draw that's going to be applied. I don't have any draw. We can lock one of our units. We can deploy boost and allied unit for duration. Frost on the opposite row. Damage the unit by one or two if I have dominance. Okay, so dominance is important. I'm, I'm finding we have two at those, so maybe not two. And fine. So I go first, and I don't want to go first because all of my cards are reactive. Except for you. There's a cooldown on that. Nice. But he'll probably end up killing it straight away. What is my thing? Um. Oh. So that can spawn me some frost. That could be useful. Long live me! Um. So I don't. I, I assume we have dominance. This is a test. Yes. Um, and we can. I mean, you've already played your order, so it's not that important. Enough. Do something. Stop mucking about. Boost the allied unit for the duration. Uh... Okay, that's not what I wanted to do. I. Fine. Um, boost and allied unit. Fine. Do this. I wasn't quite sure what the other arrow was, so I just clicked the same guy, and it, it ended up moving him twice. It should just, you know, if you've clicked one order, you don't need it still highlighted. Death to the enemy! But now that I know that it works that way... So what does he do? Summon all copies of this unit from your deck. Fine. But what we're going to do... I mean, we're going to attack him. Purify an enemy unit. Uh, block him. Because I could just damage him, but... Um... What, what was happening there? Okay. Again, purifying a unit. What's... Remove two armor from all units and on our own damage them by two. Deploy, purify an enemy unit. I just... Was like fine. I'll purify my guy. This one has the force of a cockroach. And he's passing, which means I win. Annihilation. I'm not sure it was, or is it just two cards remaining in hand? Play one ranked game. There you go. GG. Table manners. I accept if he didn't GG. Because I was slow, I'm still trying to learn, I'm sorry. Journey. So this is the journey. But I still... I'm trying to try this one. I still don't understand what journey means. Experience. So I'm now three, level three. Exit journey. What is journey? So I've made it. To level one, so I have the happy Siri avatar because that's the tick on it. Is that what that means? Don't know. Exit. Right, claim. We'll claim some stuff. 
Try it, they said. Play an online match in any mode. No, I have none. Reward book. Oh, no rewards. Understandable. The other reward book tabs will unlock after the completion of at least one tree. Okay, so I have points. Or I have to unlock. Oh, this was the thing I thought. Did I not put some points in here? Or was I only thinking about it last time? I can't remember. So it costs one key, of which I have seven. That costs key, key, key. Okay, so it's keys all the way through. Um, and again, keys and stuff. Four. So I guess we'll just go down this tree. If you finish the whole faction pack, then you get five monster kegs, a black card, and a monster's order. Ideal for new players, also your favorite point faction pack comes with... Oh no, that's if I buy now. Or is it if I win the thing? It's not very clear. They could have done a much better job with their user interface. Spend reward points to claim. Yes, fine. I mean, what are the other usages for reward points? Presumably nothing. So we have a monster keg somewhere. Uh, finish one matches in any online mode. We only have to win it. I've accepted a new quest. And I can convert this into ore. Like, is there any reason why I can't go on? Oh, no, I have to actually do this first. Fine. Okay. At least it's stopping you in some way. Um, and by spending one reward point, it just gives me nine. I'm okay with this, I guess. I mean, I'll save them up. If I'm just going to be playing this tree, I'll... You know, because then on the next time I'll spend one... Oh, no, then it's a quest. So it kind of does force you to slow down a bit. Fine, I'll still keep them saved up. We'll do one at a time. Claim, rewards, table banners. Reward point. And annihilation. Reward point. In quite a few of those now. No one here, I can open up my keg and look at this quest, I guess. Does it really take just as long to leave the matchmaking as it does for us to find a match? Smash, smash. Yeah, go on, smash, smash. So, monsters, we have Rot Fiend, damage a random enemy unit by five. On death. Deploy on the melee row, consume an allied unit. Uh, this unit triggers Thrive an additional time. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, then please leave a like. And if you think you would enjoy more, then please subscribe or even join me live on Twitch. Whilst it's cliche, all of these will help the channel. On screen is something carefully curated or something the YouTube algorithm suggests, or maybe even both. In any case, have a great day.